I finally figured out how to fix my thin hairline, man. All right, this was my first cut in weeks, man. And y'all see I'm hyped because the beard coming in crazy, man. You know what's going on. But the side of my head looking crazy, boy. So I went ahead and set that first guideline for the taper at the crease of my ear. And these babyless liners is hitting, boy. Then I grabbed my clippers and went up about a half inch. And I'm flicking at the top because the hair is kind of long and it's hanging over top the blades a little bit. And I want to make sure I cut everything. Then I grabbed my one guard, lever open, and went straight up about another half inch. Got to make sure you comb that hair back in place in between the steps, too. Then I grabbed my 1.5 guard, lever open, and I'm just flicking at that dark area at the top of the taper so it could blend better. Now I'm putting on my 0.5 guard, also known as a zero guard, and I'm closing the lever. And I'm just flicking at that middle line to get that boy out so the taper can be as blurry as possible. And make sure you're flicking, because if you go straight up, you're going to take your taper up too high. Go walk around looking crazy. But if that don't work, take the guard off, open up the lever, and gently flick at that middle line with the corner of your clippers. And be careful, because if you do too much, you will mess up that taper. Now I close the lever up, and I'm flicking out that first guideline we made earlier with the liners. And I did do the left taper too, but when I did it, it came out a little bit lower than the right taper, you know what I mean? But can't nobody see both sides of my head at the same time, bro. So I'm done touching it, man. Look good enough to me. Now it's time for the lineup, man. Right here, I'm just wiping it off with alcohol to get all the oils off. Then I hit that boy with the freeze spray to hold everything in place so I can get that thing crispy. Now let's get surgical, man. Let me work. Boom, first swipe. Liner is hitting, boy. And the corners is thin, so I ain't gonna dig in there too much. And I don't wanna hear no type of pushback talk. I'm not pushing my stuff back. Now I'm trying to hit that vertical bar, but that boy is sparse. Can't even see it. That's good enough right there, though. Not even going to do too much. Now I'm going to use the corner of my liners to hit that C cup and try to get that curve in there. Now here's how my lineup looks naturally before I fix it up. And before I do anything else to my hairline, I like to curl my hair up to really expose them thin areas. Now I'm about to turn into an artist on y'all boys, man. Watch how I really get that boy right. Right here it's hard to see, but I got my hair fibers, and I'm just spraying that thin area in in the front. Look at this, bro. These things go crazy, man. <laughs> hey, black me out. I'm going to hit the side with them, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Them boys tinted. 5%, man. I ain't done yet, though. I'm about to ink them boys up. Now, watch Picasso work, man. Hit that boy with a quick few swipes. Oh, yeah. This is going to come out crazy. Let me hit that left corner. Black that boy out. And the lineup already coming in crazy, bro. We trust in the process, man. Quick swipe on the vertical bar. That boy came in a little too dark. I ain't trying to make it look too unnatural, know what I mean? But I just swiped that boy with my finger a little bit to take some of it out. Now I'm going to get a smidge of on that C cup just to add a little bit of definition. And you see I'm turned up right now, man. Hairline's starting to go crazy. Let me hit that left side so it can match. A little bit on the C cup. Oh, yeah. That thing coming in crispy, man. Now I'm going to hit that boy with the gold babyless liners. And this the home stretch, so I can't mess it up right here, man. Hit that corner. Take that nasty beard off my face. And oh my gosh, we in there, boy. And the lineup is going stupid, boy. All I'm missing is a spice ball. <laughs> Shout out to Sly Honcho, man. Yes, sir.